He brings light into the darkness. A testimony by Carol Kuckendall. When I am afraid, I put my trust in you. Psalm 56, 3. In the days leading up to a recent medical procedure, I faced many growing what-if fears about cancer again. I've dealt with these fears before, and I've gotten pretty good at knowing what to do with them. First, I picture myself gathering all my fears and putting them in an imaginary dark room. Then I stand at the door and ask Jesus to go into that room with me, and, of course, he agrees. We enter together, and I'm immediately aware that his presence brings light into the darkness. Slowly, he walks beside me as, one by one, I look my worst possible fears right in the face. Jesus watches, silent and patient. I'm thankful he doesn't try to talk me out of my fears or remind me how many times fear not is repeated in the Bible. I sense that he understands and his presence validates the reality of my fears. He simply stands quietly beside me and that is enough. Finally, when I'm ready, we walk out of the room because I don't have to stay there. I faced my fears with Jesus, and now I know, even if one of those fears becomes a reality in my future, Jesus will be right beside me. I carried that trust with me as I wheeled down the hospital hall for the procedure and afterward, as I waited in recovery for the doctor to come tell me the results. Suddenly, he appeared. And with a smile, he said, You're clean. Dear Lord, fears feel less fearful when I know you are with me, Jesus, and you are always enough. Amen.
we love to hear from you. Because this is your house, your home. We welcome you, Lord, we welcome you. This is your Let not your heart be troubled. Ye believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself. That where I am, there ye may be also. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father, but by me. If ye love me, Keep my commandments, and I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you forever. Peace I leave with you, my peace I give unto you. Not as the world giveth give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be afraid.